Hello, my name is Chris Eckersley and I'm the Business Development Manager for EMA Blue Tracker Marine Products Division. EMA has been going for 20 years as a company and five years ago we identified a gap in the marine products market and decided to bring our innovative skills to this area. One of the products I'm going to talk to you about today is Blue Tracker LRIT. LRIT stands for Long Range Identification and Tracking. Some years ago, the International Maritime Organization made it mandatory for all ships over 300 tonnes gross weight to have an LRIT terminal on their vessel in order to sail. There are four reasons for this. The first of them is maritime security. Secondly, they need the tracking. Thirdly, it has to be a global system. And lastly, a centralised database. LRIT is Long Range Identification and Tracking. This should not be confused with the AIS system, which is a short range VHF system. We're now going to look in more detail how the LRIT system works when it's on a ship. The ship has its terminal, which sends the information to the carrier service provider on the satellite, which then sends it to the ground station, which then sends it to the application service provider, who are the people who issue the radio conformance certificate to the ship. This data is not commercial data and is only available to the flag state data center. The data center will put that information into the international data exchange, which is secure and encrypted, and will be available to other registered authorized data users should they need to query the position of that ship. When EMA decided to develop an LRIT terminal, we leveraged on our innovative knowledge from previous terminals using a unique housing, which you can see here, which is a double skin housing, which allows air cooling, which will keep the unit cool in warm climates, but also keep it at operational temperatures in cold climates. We partnered with Iridium, who have a low earth operational satellite system with 66 satellites covering the whole globe and the Iridium module is housed within here. In addition to that, we have the GPS module and also the aerial within the housing. And as you can see underneath, there is one cable which takes the data and the power. So this is why you should use a Blue Tracker LRIT terminal from EMA, because it's easy to fit, it can go on a mast, it can go on a rail, it can go on a pole. And within the terminal, are our special electronics which enable it to operate in difficult environments and the housing is rated to IP69. During the development of the LRIT Blue Tracker device, we identified some niche requirements for C Area 4. In this area, which is above 70 degrees on the globe, the Arctic requirements mean devices have to operate in extremely low temperatures and our innovative electronic skills enabled us to develop an Arctic version of the LRIT Blue Tracker which operates from a cold start at minus 55 degrees centigrade. This was tested and tried by the Canadian Coast Guard last summer when three of their vessels had Blue Tracker Arctic versions installed and went to the North Pole for three months. The data received and what from them when they return to base enable them to write a report and certificate the device that Blue Tracker Arctic version was suitable for use in Sea Area 4. Now the combination of Iridium satellites, which are the only satellites that operate in that area, and the, Irid and the LRIT device from EMA, the Blue Tracker, means that the only device and only terminal that can operate successfully, reliably, in Sea Area 4 is Blue Tracker. To summarise our presentation of LRIT, we now know why we need it and how it works, and that the IMO have made it mandatory as of July 2009 for all vessels over 300 tonnes to have an LRIT terminal on board. As of June 2010, the IMO will also make it mandatory for every vessel over 300 tonnes to have an LRIT terminal on board for Sea Area 4. And as previously mentioned, 
the Blue Tracker Arctic version using the Iridium satellite network is the only certified device that can operate in these areas. We feel we have a technical advantage by having this certification and testing. We also have commercial advantages. You can purchase a package including your hardware, your conformance test, your retest if required and the option to have commercial tracking directly from us at bluetracker.com. If you require further information, please visit our website at www.bluetracker.com. Thank you.